Hey guys, welcome back to the Daily Chat. Today we are gonna talk about some tips on helping you land the job interview stage. Now for a lot of us, this could be the part that we absolutely dislike, but let's face it, we have to get through this part in order to get the job. Today I'm gonna be sharing with you some do's and don'ts about the job interview stage. So let's jump right in. We are gonna start with some things not to do on a job interview. Number one is don't show up late. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry I was late. Like you don't understand. There was like four different accidents and everybody decided to be on the road today. Listen, I really tried to get here on time, but I just couldn't like, but I'm really ready for my job interview. I mean, are you ready? Oh, can we get started? I don't wanna waste any more of your time. Huh? <laughs> Number two, don't have a weak handshake. Man, that was a really firm handshake. No, no, I don't prefer to squeeze the life and blood out of someone's hands, but um, you sure do give a good handshake there. <laughs> Number three, don't talk too much. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy you asked me about my previous employer. So <laughs> that place was just a madhouse. Like, <sighs> the boss was horrible, the people were horrible. All they wanted to do was talk all day. I mean, like, who has time to talk all day? I mean, like, people, we got work to do. I mean, we had really fun parties. I mean, I remember getting really drunk at the Christmas party. <laughs> Number four, don't chew gum. So, as you can see, I've worked almost everywhere. Um, I've had a lot of retail experience. And, oh my gosh, this gum is so good. What's your favorite gum, by the way? Juicy fruit? I don't have juicy fruit, but it's it's still really good. And number five is don't wear too much that it becomes a distraction. What was that? You, you like my necklace? Oh my gosh, thank you. I like wanted to wear this so bad. I thought it went great with my checkered plaid flannel, you know, sweater for this job interview. You know, I saw on your website, you said you guys were creative and I said like, why shouldn't I wear my kale shirt? Hello. But I'm so glad you like my necklace. I mean, thank you. It's distracting? What? It's not distracting. I think it brings out my lipstick. Don't you think so? I love it. Now that we went through some of the things not to do, let's go over the things that you should do. Starting with number one, make sure to turn off your phone. Number two, make sure to dress professionally. Number three, make sure that you print out your resume the night before. And not only that guys, make sure that you don't fold it up and present it like an origami to the interviewer. Number four, make sure to have good eye contact. And the last one coming in at number five, make sure that you research the company. I think this is a tip that sometimes gets slipped under the rug, but you never know. They may ask you just some brief questions about you and the company, the culture of the company, and if you didn't do your homework and see all that information the night before or even one or two days before, you might be stuck in that question. Make sure you know what job you're applying for, what their mission statement is, what their background is, because it can really help boost some extra points in that job interview. Yes, I actually noticed that when I did a little research on your company, I saw that you guys are the top competitor when it comes to marketing. That's it for this video, guys. I hope you picked up one or two tips on what you should and shouldn't do on a job interview. Wishing you best of luck on your next job interview. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure that you like and subscribe. And as always, remember that every day matters. I'll see you guys next time.